Hello, hello, my lovelies. Sigita visa video for you guys. At last, I got a video for you, little one, but a short one. <coughs> Simply because I'm not well, so I'm getting better. So <laughs> I can do video for you too. Yeah, a little bit down with uh, cold and temperature. Uh, but we'll be all right, of course. Uh, but, but this time somehow it does take slow, does take longer uh, than usual. Anyway, so I'm sorry for my voice. Is what is not going to be so important uh, to what I'm talking about. Uh, it's more is going to be what I'm doing, right? So I just made this page. I am a making envelope journal right allah how this turned out this is on my piertron and this as well i think was on my piertron embellishing and envelopes 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 then will be as well a little bit of stitching of course uh you can't go without stitching so will be a different size envelopes only and some stitched pages and some bags, these little bags I have to join, these envelopes. So yeah, but I love this page and I haven't, um, I haven't used sewing paper for quite a while. And just because I'm preparing these uh, photos for another mixed media journal set, to cover a back, I'm using a uh, sewing pattern paper. And I was like, oh my god, I haven't used it for a while. And actually, I came up with a really nice page, which you all guys, of course, know. I just, again, want to remind you or inspire you, you know, at least show, at least <laughs> sometimes show up. No, we'll be alright, guys. I think I will be maybe even more so anyway so what i did i just glued down a rusted uh magazine page right just ordinary magazine page right and then of course i want to ink edges this i'm not inking edges yet because it is still damp but i somehow I want to <clears throat> I want to ink this yeah so autumn is coming and straight away <coughs> I'm sorry guys I'm so sorry for sniffing but at least you have <laughs> at least you have video alright so let's glue this down I love this large paper, um, flower and here I love how it comes up like in, um, I don't think as you can see, but it comes up as a texture, like a raised up texture. I really like that. Right. So most of, of my videos are on Piatron but yeah this will be for you so i'm going down pictures of art house whimsy love her um her pictures are beautiful uh lately i have been using just her uh i think just her pictures right that's beautiful so I want to put under something. Right. Uh, that picture, if you don't know yet. Look, I cut it out. I purchased the Art House Whimsy as well. Like um, Fussy Cut Flowers. Uh, fussy Cut Flowers. Right, I need scissors. 
I think I want to. Okay, I will cut out. I will cut out the sunflower. And then I come back. Right, I cut it out. Inked it. And then I really like that. And not a lot of pieces, guys. Not always we need, you know, full page of many details. <clears throat> so let's. Right, let's try to do some stitching. I uh, I'm taking three stand, not six. Six will be very. I just have it. Six will be very thick because we are going to cover it so I don't want it to be such a thick piece <clears throat> Nice and easy, just let's do some crosses. Where could we place it? Okay, let's leave it this way. <clears throat> let's put down that fabric first. And then let's see how we can manage with that sunflower. See, we can go this way. Right, is that going to be all? <laughs> That's a good question. I just said that you don't have to... You don't have to... Feeling all page. Look what I'm doing. <laughs> right, let's put this on down.
get it right away like that nice Somehow I need something white. Now let's see, is my marker going to be working or not? I'm just trying to get paint oh okay wait it does look it's going to so what i just do a little dot little dot And that's in hotel. Yeah. And now simply I'm taking larger piece of paper and I will glue it over. So first what I will do is I actually go over with a glue stick over this sewing paper. It is fine, you can go over. Like that. And then I just place it over that page and look don't rub too hard right but if you make any <coughs> holes that's fine but i'm not really going for that <laughs> look this time right and i'm just going a little bit over with it's a damp cloth We will bring out everything anyway. Well, I just want to get it down. Right. I glued it more. So what's on this? Okay. We are not folding over. We just nicely. I don't want to cut it off. You know that. And I just want to tear it down. I think this is the hardest part. Let's see, that was easy. right nice and now it's not completely down it's not like bringing up 
that nice look yet. So we are going on it over the top with something. I am using acrylic wax. I still have it. Uh, as I, I think I have been mentioning many times, Art Von Go. I purchased it when I was in the UK quite a couple of years ago. Right. Uh, I would love to purchase it more, but uh, <clears throat> I understood that they are not shipping abroad, like, or to Europe. I did, um, I did contact them and uh, with a question, do you ship uh, to Europe? And there was no response, so I don't know. But if you don't have uh, acrylic wax, don't worry whatsoever. You can use Mod Podge, right? I just love that waxy look. Look at that. It's dry. It's almost dry. Beautiful. And not very, you know, as, again, not very heavily brushing over, but clear all that. And that's only place where I saw it. I looked over in on the internet on <clears throat> Amazon as well. Uh, that is only place I think they produce it. I know that Art Van Gogh, I have been there for quite a few workshops because that place, that uh, little town, was uh, next to my place where I used to live. So I know that place quite well, but they are not responding to my question. So, yeah, look at that beautiful, beautiful effect, guys. Look at that. Nice and easy. Uh, and now if you change your mind and you want something to add more, of course, you can add on the top of it. Okay, there is no problem with that. I can just use glue and add it. something on the top. Uh, I think I will have to go over with ink more. But, oh, and even dots came up. Look at that. And so this is, and then this, beautiful. You know what, I actually, what I'm thinking, I actually am very keen to cover these all, all envelopes like that. I really love the effect. So nothing I can, <laughs> nothing I can do here. Maybe I can cover that little flap on this page. Envelope, I can cover this part, right? And I can go over with acrylic over that. Beautiful, really, really beautiful effect. I'm kind of, I'm kind of scared to go over because I don't want to spoil it. I really like it. No, it's okay. I'm not. I will leave like that. Love it. So, my lovelies, I hope this was a little stitching as well. Look. And when it dries, it will uh, be even more, uh, like, clear. So, I hope this, guys, uh, was inspiring, inspiring for you to do uh, something similar. But, yeah, I'm just thinking about myself that um, quite a few of these envelopes I will embellish this way. I think this will be very very interesting okay my lovelies thank you so so much my lovelies 
I hope see I hope I I wish I can say see you soon. Uh yeah, see you soon. Because we, we will see you soon anyway, because I'm finishing this journal. Uh cover will be stitched. Cover will be stitched. Fabric cover. Yeah. So let's see, let's see how this all goes. But yeah, I'm kind of excited about this. Okay, my lovelies, see you soon. Okay, have a great week, weekend soon. Um, get better to myself. <laughs> get better to myself, Beth. If you are watching, I will post your parcel. I hope on Monday. Okay, I I because Saturday Sunday post office doesn't work. So I hope uh, Monday, latest Monday. Still, I'm not, I am not. don't really want to go out tomorrow. I'm kind of okay today. Right. So anyway, my lovelies. Um, take care of yourself. Okay. Autumn is coming. Winter is coming. And uh, happy crafting. And once more, see you soon. Bye.